Hey everyone, Christian here. So I'm sure you've been watching a lot of YouTube videos or Twitch videos of One Hour One Life, and you saw that people had some interesting things in their game that you didn't have. Um, whether it be zooming in and out, they were able to die in their mother's arms before they turned one year old, or maybe they just had a couple of HUD notifications saying their age, whether they were able to produce babies still, or whether there were any females left in their family. There's a couple more things you can do with this mod, but those are just a few. Well, all of that was made possible because of a community member named OBS. Now he created this mod and it is a life changer. So basically to install this mod, you're going to go to this website here, it, link is going to be in the description, and you click on the very first link here. You're going to download this link and you're going to be given a folder that looks like this, or a zip that looks like this, and of course you're going to click close. Um, you're going to have these five items here, and you're going to actually copy all of these items over to your folder in Steam. So you're going to open up your folder here. You're going to go to your PC, your hard drive. You're going to go to Program Files. Then you're going to scroll down to Steam. You're going to go to Steam Apps, and then you're going to go to Common. Now here at Common, you're going to look for your game, One Hour, One Life. So what you're going to want to do is copy these four items over to this folder, just like so. Here you got it, first names, instructions, last names, names info, and one life plus. Now I have three things here because I've already done this, but I'm gonna show you guys how to do it anyway. So you can close out of that, and if you want to figure out how the mod works, as soon as you're done installing it, you click on the instructions, and you have all of the commands here. Uh, it could be in a notepad or any word processing program that you use. So after you do that, you're not going to have to do anything else with that. So you can close the folder. You can, however, create a desktop if you want to, or a desktop shortcut, but you don't have to. So now you're going to go in here to Steam, and you're going to go to Games, and you're going to click on Add a non-Steam game to my library. From here, you're going to want to Browse. You're going to want to locate the, at, or the folder, One Hour, One Life. If it's not already here, you're going to go Program Files, just as you did, Steam, Steam apps, common, scroll down or wherever you have to go, one hour, one life, and you're gonna wanna go to the executable. Now, the one that you downloaded is gonna be one life plus. So this is the one that you want. One life is already on there because you installed the game through Steam. One life plus plus isn't gonna exist because that's what I named. So you're gonna go one life plus. You're gonna click on that, you're gonna hit open. It's gonna show up here and there's gonna be a check mark next to it. So now you're going to add selected programs. Now if you go to your library, you scroll down, you have one hour, one life, and then you have one life plus. One hour, one life is the actual game. One life plus is what you just created. This is going to be your mod. Now again, you can create a shortcut however you wish. You can just go to the folder and right click create shortcut, or you can just click on play here. Now once you click on play, it's going to load up. Your game is gonna launch. It's gonna do as it was ground textures, everything. It's gonna show your information and you're gonna click on log in. Now your screen might be zoomed in a little bit because you're not zoomed out yet. If you see though, I am zoomed out. You see my age down here, you see my status up here, my mother just named me Hammer, and you zoom in with your left and right keys. Now you can do a couple other things with the mod, but I'm just here to show you guys how to install it. So just check out the instructions in the folder that you downloaded and you will be well on your way. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.